All right, now the notification is something very important for us. We keep checking the notifications on our phone every now and then and managing the notification is very, very important. Now by default, Notification management is pretty good on the Samsung Galaxy phones on One UI 6.0 and to enhance the notifications and to manage the notifications in a better and smarter way, we do get a good luck module called NotiStar. And for this module, Samsung has pushed out a brand new update with some new features which further enhances the notification experience. In this video, let's go ahead and check it out. Now as you can see, in the change log, the all new version is 6.0.32.00 and in the change log, we've got a few points here. The first one is fixed layout bug. Then we've got support flip five cover widget, which is not applicable for uh, the rest of the phones. And then we've got this bug fix here. The next two points talk about some new features. First one is show bigger image if notification has image. Then we've got long press notification to save image. Now these two points sound interesting. Let me go ahead and tell you what exactly this is all about. Now first let me open the NotiStar module. The moment you open it, you will see all the notifications which you have received even if you have dismissed or cleared them from the notification panel or the quick panel. So this application allows you to check all your notification history even if you have cleared them and this is also available by default on One UI 6.0 now. You will be able to see the notification history on the system itself. Now let's talk about the new feature. Whenever you get a notification which contains an image, the entire image will be shown right here on this notification screen. Let me just send an image from WhatsApp from another phone to this phone. Now I have received the image. To check this, I have enabled this uh, notice star on the lock screen. I can just swipe up on this icon to open the notification through notice star. Here it is. As you can see, the image is showing up on the notification, which was not the case earlier. The entire image was not showing up. It was only notifying the message and a tiny image icon on the right hand side. But now we can see the entire image right here. That is the first feature. The second feature is we will be able to directly save this image into the gallery right from here by just pressing and holding on the image. Now this wasn't there earlier. Earlier we could only see copy and share option. And now after this all new update, we get this new option save image. We can just press and hold on the image that you want to save. Tap on save image, it gets saved into the gallery. That's the second new feature we have got. Now after this update, it has become very convenient to see the image on the notice starts notification panel and directly save it right from here. Now we can see the image on the default notification of the quick panel as well, but we will not be able to directly save it right from there. We will have to open the notification and then save that image. Whereas here we can directly save the image right from this notification panel. This is the all new feature that we have got for the NotiStar application. Apart from these new features, we do have some useful features available on this app. You can select the applications from which you want to get the notifications. We've got something called user filter list. We can specify which keywords or applications you want to see. And if you don't want to use notice star on the lock star, you can just disable it. And if you have enabled it, you can also further customize this icon. You can select the color you want and then change the transparency depending on your requirement and customize the icon. As you can see, this app stores notifications for up to 30 days, which is just brilliant. These are some of the useful features on Notice Star which you guys should explore. And with this all new update, the new features are going to enhance the notification viewing experience. So go ahead, check the update if it is available in your region, download it and install it. And if you don't have uh, the good lock application in your region, you can uh, download the nice lock or find lock and download the APKs. But you may not be able to get the latest APKs with the latest new features on uh, these modules. So be wary of that. But if you already have uh, the good lock in your region by default, then you will be able to download these new features and enjoy them. Let me know how many of you guys do not have good luck in your region. Drop a comment and also mention the country you are commenting from. That is all I wanted to share with you guys. Thanks for watching. If you haven't subscribed to the channel already, go ahead, smash the subscribe button and become a part of Apex community and give this video a like if you find this video informational. Thanks for watching. My name is Salyan signing off. Cheers. Bye-bye.